what is going on guys if you are like me and you bought this box and paid 190 dollars at la collecticon or you bought it online and you paid something similar don't freak out let's talk about it so if you guys aren't familiar um i only have one of these boxes but i did pay 190 dollars um they were going like i think some of them touched 200 for a while um but like i said i got this at la collecticon paid cash um so yeah they announced a reprint if you're not familiar um and that's happening in may but i kind of wanted to talk to you about what i think is going to happen and moving forward um because if you guys aren't familiar these boxes retail in japan for 38 dollars so um but the demand for 151 whether it's english or japanese is insane it's such a good set so um just with the reprint announced and like not even happening um let's just dive into um some stuff here real quick um let's open up ebay um so these are last solds on ebay um 143 140 136 140 so around 140 dollars um this one seems sketch yeah that's not legit um i don't think these ones are legit either this this one could be but just, this seller has good feedback but this one if somebody got this oh this is opened it's for an open box <laughs> okay so um you can see it's about 140 bucks just since the reprint's been announced and they were like at 200 um so that's quite a big people are trying to offload um right now so um what's going to happen and you guys can see if you guys aren't familiar with this website um sneaker dunk um i guess i just heard about them recently but a lot of people are saying there it's a legit way to buy um, Pokemon cards, as you can see here, we got the 151 box. This is the pricing currently. Um, and they were one of the first uh, websites to have lower pricing. Um, it can vary, obviously. I'm not sure exactly sure how this works. I've never used them before, but $93 for one box. And obviously, there's going to be some sort of shipping in there, so keep that in mind. But um, it seems like the best deal is around five boxes for $488. Um, anyways, the point with all of that is with the reprint how low like should you be buying these boxes at 140 dollars now i would guess that that would probably be a bad idea it's just my guess and i could be wrong and demand could just be like so so high but i just wanted to talk about like kind of my approach having that one box you know already at 190 um you got a few options. Say you have more boxes than me. Um, you could be dollar cost averaging right now. And if you're buying some more boxes at 140, you're going to bring your average cost down, um, which could be good. But I think you should hold off. Whether you're investing or collecting or just flipping, however you want to do it, I think that these are going to be sub 100 boxes um, after this reprint. I really do. I think that Pokemon knows the and um they don't as a rule they don't want these boxes to be crazy high prices because the demand is so high and they only sell at the you know the msrp so it's not like they it's not like they get to jack up the prices as well so they want to sell as many boxes as they can bring that price down so everyone can get it so i think that this is going to be a really large reprint and i think these are going to be sub 100 dollars boxes now with 151 being so popular i think it's going to kind of have a premium um to it so i'm thinking around because i mean some of the other japanese boxes you can get right now between like 50 bucks 40 and 50 bucks depending um so like i mean let's let's just take a look at that real quick and let's do um what's the latest like uh crimson haze i think let's just check that out real quick All right, so last solds, like, here we go. This is, like, the newest set. This one went for, no, it's crossed out. So 51, 50, 50, here's a case, 50 bucks. Someone paid 75. So around 50 bucks, somewhere a little higher. I guess not in the 40s for this set, but I've seen other sets um, in the 40s. So 50 bucks for the brand new set. And you got to keep in mind that MSRP is $38 um, when you do the conversion. So I would, this is just my guess, at 50 bucks for the newest set, 
that 151 when the reprint comes out if they print as much as i think that they're going to print we're going to be looking at an 80 dollar box 80 85 that's just my guess i could be completely wrong but so for me i'm waiting for the reprint and i'm waiting for the reprint to hit and i mean if i can if you can get in and order with through at like on the japanese pokemon center it can be hard to order there you you can use some other websites to like kind of get around that um but that would be my advice because that's gonna that's gonna bring this bo- this box if i pick up a few more boxes at a lower price then my average cost on this box is going to be so much lower and so even if you just want to rip boxes if you guys if you guys should just wait there's i don't think you guys should be scooping up these 140 boxes these are sellers trying to get out of positions that you know they they bought a large quantity and now they're kind of trying to offload and you know I'd, if you're a seller you know i'm sorry but it's a kind of a tough position to be in right now but um that's just my prediction um i'll revisit this and i'll talk about this again when when the reprint comes out and i could be like i said i could be totally wrong um but it'll be interesting. Just I'm calling 80, 85 dollar boxes. Could be wrong. Let me know um, in the description or uh, in the comments. Sorry, what you guys think? Um, is an 80 dollar box possible for this? Let me know. Um, while you're there, if you if you guys are this far in the video, hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button if you're not already. It would mean a lot to me. Um, this is just kind of a little update. I wanted to talk about the 151. Kind of let the dust settle. A lot of people were talking about it, you know, right when the announcement happened. But I just kind of wanted to like see. Because initially they dropped debt prices down and it was like 170. Anyways, so it's kind of like the dust is settling around 140. I still think there's room to go. But um, that's going to do it for this one, guys. I just wanted to kind of give you guys my opinion. Um, and yeah, I will definitely be trying to load up on some boxes um, as cheap as I can get them. From where, I don't know. I'm going to look into that. I might make a video on that um, later. But um, that's going to do it for this one, guys. I'll see you in the next one. And remember, guys, it was never a phase.